Elected Congressman Morgan McGarvey of Louisville gave his first speech on the House floor today. This speech comes one day after the House passed the Born Alive Abortion Survivors Protection Act. The act would require health care providers to try to preserve the life of an infant in the rare case that a baby is born alive during or after an attempted abortion. Opponents have argued such measures restrict abortion access by threatening health care providers. McGarvey in his speech today defended abortion rights. And my district overwhelmingly rejected a constitutional amendment to further restrict reproductive rights in Kentucky. So how do we respond here? Last night, the House Republicans' first order of business was to make it even harder for women to receive abortions and for health care professionals to provide them. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer said Wednesday that the bills are, quote, doomed in the Senate and extreme. Here in Kentucky, abortions are still banned due to a trigger law after the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade. There's also no decision from our Supreme Court yet on the request for an injunction to block the trigger law. The Kentucky Supreme Court heard oral arguments in November on the multiple challenges to the state's trigger law. Since then, two new justices, including Louisville's Angela Bizick McCormick, have joined the court replacing those that have retired. Right now, it's unclear if an opinion will come from the new court or the old court or when that opinion may come down.